Hi, I'm Candice Warner. And I'm David Warner. And this is our Body and Soul cover shoot. I feel at my strongest when I'm in complete control of my life. Getting up early, getting enough sleep at night, having the kids in a really good routine and then setting aside an hour for myself. And what about you? When do you feel at your strongest? Very similar, but for me it's running, nutrition, sleep and recovery. Playing the odd game of golf, but making- The odd, the odd <laughs> game of golf. What's your shortcut to feeling stronger? I wouldn't take it as a shortcut. It's having a routine, making sure that I'm making the most of every day. I do love going to the gym. I go three times a week, but it's not always necessarily being in there for an hour. It could just be half an hour, high intensity. So you do take shortcuts? No. <laughs> it's a <laughs> shorter amount of time. When would you feel our relationships at its strongest? When I'm at home. <laughs> we just gel so well, so it's routine. I have to fit back into the routine. Yeah, you upset the routine you, sometimes. You, you do have a great routine with the <laughs> girls and what they do with their extracurricular activities. It's making sure that I uphold my end of the bargain as well, which is uh, trying to help you around the house, which happens sometimes. Yeah, like you said, when we're together um, and we're both hands-on with our kids, our relationship is at its strongest. When do you think your mind is at its strongest? My mind at my strongest would be when I'm very clear. Spending time with yourself and, and the kids, that's when I'm at my clearest. When we're communicating, when we're really clear in, in what we're trying to achieve as a, as a couple. This could be a relationship advice <laughs> <Yeah>. documentary. <laughs> what song is it that gets you going or makes you feel strong? I don't, I don't have one. All right, what I, song do you love? I don't really have a song. Yes, that I you're love. always singing at home. No, I'm not always singing. What about when you got your 335 or whatever it was, not out in Adelaide? What was the song? Toot toot chugga chugga big red car. No, that wasn't the song. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was listening to the Wiggles. It was always in my head. Obviously, having kids um, can do that to you. You listen to a lot of R&B, so do listen this to could be explicit. No, 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 no. I'm really a mixture. Some days I even like Andrea Bocelli. So Rolling Stones? Rolling Stones, big fan of the Rolling Stones. Anything with a good beat, generally. I think you missed your calling when you be a singer? I played the <laughs> drums when I was younger at school, but no, no good as a singer. Strength for me is having that resilience. When you get knocked down to get back up, it's that inner strength that you need to pick yourself up when you're not having a good day, when your back's against the wall. Having kids was the biggest thing because both being sports people, you being a very disciplined individual athlete coming from a cricket background being a team, we lose our sense of what we're about and it's all about the kids. And I think that was our biggest change and I think we really you know, stepped up and I think you, you stepped up incredibly well. And so I felt like that is what we're about as a, yeah, as a team. Yeah, and I believe that, you know, physical strength will only get you so far, but if you've got that, that inner strength, that um, strength of mind, it'll get you a lot further.